like, I haven't seen him in years. Yeah. Well, his type wasn't monkey, but I didn't know him as uh, something else. He played Snake and Brawl. Yeah, yeah. All right, anyway, on to this match. So we have Roy Ross. That's why uh, Andy Starr was using uh, the Ross tag. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's actually Roy Ross with the paint glasses. Yeah, and Scourge like is actually going with uh, Sanic. Oof. And he's he is going in right now. Uh, mind you, this is not custom death. This is the the, the default Sanic. Right. Yeah, Scorch actually is wants to prove that he's not reliant on Hammer Sonic to win. And as you can see, that is very true. Look oh. at that. Already ahead by so much. Yeah, he almost took that stock. And he did with that up air. The up air is out and on the field. Oh, man. Scourge is just running away with this. No pun intended. Oh, yeah. And Aaron Star was just looking at him and was like, did you really just take me out in less than a minute? He just ate me, dude. Yeah, they were exchanging some words over there. And the thing about Scourge is that he knows every matchup in this game because he plays every character in this game. Yeah. Uh, Andy, he's been grinding out games simply with Bowser Jr. Yep. That, yeah, it, yeah, has, it hasn't been holding him back. The guy's been uh, he's doing really well in tournament. Oh, yeah, he has. But he's, he's basically uh, against Scourge. He's no slouch when yeah. it comes to this. When it comes to this game, he he can play basically any character and do either decent or exceptionally well. Right. But yeah, he's right now just keeping such good control of this stage. A lot of extra credit too. Yeah. Oh, but good uh good follow from the cart using a uh, back air right there. Yeah. Oh, ah, grab them right out of the side B. Good combo. Straight to that up B four there. Scorch is really punishing Andy for these landings. Yeah. Oh, and did he just? It's Andy the going to do it. Yeah, he, he, he spring gimped them twice. Man. Wow. The double spring gimp. Really? Like, yo, you gotta level up if you're gonna come against me. Man. Very convincing. The one day that, that Scorch decides to actually use his main, yeah. Aside than using his other characters. And no customs, man. He said, look, no I don't need it. He doesn't need it. I don't need it. He no hammer sonic hammer. for this. Uh, hammer spin dash for this man. Yeah, the hammer spin dash. The, the, the whole controversy going on. At least in this region. I haven't heard it from anywhere else, but we're not yeah, going to go really into that. Yeah, it's really just been a us thing. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's move on. Yep. So game two. I wonder Yo, where... Uh, we got two more killers in the background, though. Oh, man. Is that who Pump I think it is? Magic and GP Soul. Pump Magic. Now, I don't know if Pump entered. He is a really good DDD player. The best DDD in NorCal, no yeah, doubt. Yeah, definitely. No, Pump actually did enter. Did he? Yeah. Oh, He's that actually going to be playing the winner of this match. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Right. Yeah, so I guess that's why he's uh, kind of scouting the back there. And GP, I wonder who's playing next. I want to see uh, GP's match. Yeah, GP almost definitely in winners. The guy's, you know, he's been known to win a foundry or two. But yeah. Scorch, he's going right back into it. What's crazy is that a lot of the time, players don't like to be aggressive against Bowser Jr. because they're not really sure what Bowser Jr.'s options are, you know? Yeah. It's like, is Bowser Jr. holding back because I'm not right in their face, or is Bowser Jr. as fast as uh, his strange movements make them seem? But um, Scorch is like, no, I know this character. I know what I can do. I know where he's uh, he's vulnerable. Yeah, he's exploiting it like, easily. Like, he's been racking up all the percentage when he's using a side B. Yeah. When, uh, well, rather than um, Ross, Roy Ross, using his side B. And he's punishing it exceptionally well, like right there. He just did a force match because he knew where he was going to land. The aggression is on point right now. Oh, I see, I see Scorch uh, styling a little bit there, going for the perfect pivots. Yeah. Perfect pivot down smash. That Fox tech. Yeah. Right now, uh, the neutral is just kind of like he's, he's got to stay back a bit because like Andy Sol is at 107 percent. Good combo. Yeah, that's that is yeah that is guaranteed on certain characters like 50 to 100 percent. So it was good awareness on uh, Andy Sol's part. And uh, you saw the commitment that Scorch did there, the, yeah. the classic four smash. He was ready, and you know he's he's actually picking him out at the right time to throw out those four smashes for the most part. Yeah. But, um, his timing is just a little bit off there. Would have been a kill. Yeah, see, oh, wow, that was it. a good dash up smash. Right up smash? He, he slid across smash. the room like that. <laughs> yeah, he probably jump canceled it. Yeah. Oh, I see uh, Andy Star was trying to replicate that what uh, Scourge was doing. Trying to go for those uh, little dash up smashes, but it wasn't flashy. Scourge, you know, he's, he's practicing his perfect pivot. Yeah, I, I see. Oh, there it is, yep. Oh, that, oh but we live in. Yeah, he actually didn't get the strong hit there. He got the back bar. Oh, up but that, do it. yeah, that up smash, though. It is much oh, more tight now. And he gave him the little taunt, too. A little playful taunt right there. Down air. Oh, he's trying to go for the double down airs. Yeah. That is actually work against every character. Yeah. I think Sonic's one of those exceptions. All right, good. There we go. Forward air. 
And the jab. Oh. Good percentage. All right. Andy Sorrow's not giving up without a fight. Oh, oh but he rolled right into the force match. Yeah, great smash there. See, I've been talking about this uh, earlier on in the NorCal Smash 4 group, is that Scorch is a master of fundamentals. That's why he can play any character. Yeah. He really focuses on what you're doing as his opponent, and he has a really good understanding of the cast. So those two things together, he knows where to attack. He's a very, very intelligent player. Yeah, word for word, he was saying uh, uh, he believes that everyone is viable. Yeah, he believes that everyone in this game is viable. And the oh. up smash catch! Not gonna kill though. Only problem there is that uh, you saw the spring actually push Andy a little bit higher out. Oh, wow, the back air. Didn't look like he had the DI. To, he could have lived through that, I believe. But I guess he didn't. And there it is. Uh, oh, with the swiftness, man. And you notice that uh, Andy Sorrow actually, he has a, a weak.